Hi, everybody. Welcome to New Life Live. Steve Arterburn here with Dr. John Townsend and Dr. Jill Hubbard and your phone calls. We don't see ourselves as uh, weird Christians. Steve Arterburn, author and founder of New Life Ministries in Laguna Beach, sits down every week for his Christian-based call-in counseling show called New Life Live. It's not therapy, it's advice. I work with other people and uh, it's a thing we call tag team counseling. The world has Dr. Phil, we've got Dr. Jill right here. Hi Jill. <laughs> Hi Steve. Good to see you. Good to see you. And uh, the world has, uh, I don't know, John, uh, John Boy and we have John, <laughs> Dr. John Townsend. <laughs> we've gotten along for over 15 years together and we really like each other. When somebody's talking to the caller, well, you know, you've got two other people there listening. Arterburn says he admits his own faults and takes that approach in the ministry and on the show. I had paid for a girl to have an abortion and um, I didn't really think about what I had done uh, until after it was over with and, and then I realized I actually had um, destroyed the life of my child. So getting over that was kind of my first um, introduction to hope after really a big despair. Eight years ago, Arterburn went through a divorce. I uh, got divorced three years ago, and in the last three years, it's been pretty tough. It feels like uh, as good as my ex-wife, life's going, mine's going the opposite direction. What should I do to try to get get back on my feet or get find the Lord again, or why isn't the Lord there for me? I okay. don't know. It's just All right. Now, uh, do you listen to the show very much? Oh, all the time. All right. So uh, you know that I went through the same thing that you went through, right? Not uh, 100% the whole story, well, but... I had an unfaithful spouse and uh, went through that time when, uh, wow, everything's uh, going great for the person that committed this fatal thing. I couldn't even... I was so into myself, I couldn't even look at my part for five years. So it took a long time. You're three years out, and uh, i got to say that I, I wasn't really... Uh, I would say well. I wasn't a well person. John and Jill could tell you I was not a well person <laughs> for a very long time. And so you've got to be patient with yourself. Today, most the most calls are in the form of a uh, a sex addict husband and um, a wife who doesn't know what to do. We're trying to figure out the best and most effective way to do an intervention or have a conversation with my 53 year old father about his sex addiction and um, basically okay. the ending of my parents' marriage of 31 years. Arterburn's show is now on television and he would like to see it grow some more. We would like to take uh, Dr. Laura's place uh, when she goes off in January. We're here really to make you feel bad today. We like people to feel so bad that they get in the car and go talk to somebody, do something different with their life rather than just feel like, oh, it's hopeless, it's I'm helpless. But we, there's a happy ending. There is a happy ending when you feel bad enough to get out of that house, sit down with somebody face to face, and have a need met. We'll be back right after this for more of New Life Live. Glad you're with us today here on New Life. Mark Eats reporting for OCRegister.com.